Hello everybody, welcome back to today's episode. We're putting a front lip on the white Z. Ali already sanded the whole lip down, and now he's gonna do the first uh, coat. How many coats are you gonna do? Probably like three, four coats. This is a lip from eBay, it used to be on my cart, and I, I took it off because I'm gonna do something else. Um, so we're gonna put that on to the white Z and see how that looks. I'll put a link to where I got this lip uh, down below in the description, so if you're wondering, you can go ahead and check it out. It's just from eBay, I'm sure you've seen it before. It's one of those like classic ones. This lip is polyurethane, plastic. You wanna sand it down, we sanded it down with, uh, at least sanded it down with 220 grit sandpaper. Uh, you don't wanna do too much, just enough to have something, like enough scratches so that the paint can stick on. So that's 220 grit all around. Good to go. I'm not really an expert in spray painting. I'm sure I'll use better. But um, the golden rule is to do light, even coats. Just go one side and then let go and then do the other side again. I just go back and forth and do light and even coats. Or else you might get some paint like dripping and that's not gonna look good and it's gonna, you're gonna have to deal with it. So just do light, even coats all across. Doesn't matter if your first or second coat doesn't cover up the whole thing. Once you do three or four coats, you'll eventually cover up the whole thing. When I do nothing, just cool it, cool. I know it's harder to find. You probably see me avenues in my mind, but it's all right, yeah. That was the first coat. I didn't even mention it. This paint is Rust-Oleum Universal Advanced Formula Paint and Primer in one. Any surface, any angle, fast drying, rust. Gloss black paint. Should be shiny and nice. And hopefully it'll look good. Uh, so the painting process is done. Uh, we're just test fitting it now. Damn, looks much better. We'll mount it over here on that side, and then on the sides. This should be enough. Well, people, and what I had when I had this slip on was 3M under here, and then I screwed it from the sides. You can also do that, but it's if you soft, if you don't really want to do that, then it's fine. 3M holds it pretty nice. I mean. People 3M it from like under here as well, but that's all up to you. Definitely looks, I mean, I, I think it looks better on the white than it did on my car. What some people do also is uh, paint match it to match the color of your car. And that's just your preference. If you like it, you can do that too. Can I be in your video? No, man, no. So, Ali decided he wants to mount it from here. So he drilled a hole over there, he's gonna drill one here and then Two on the sides and then one on that side you want to do one yeah. if you do decide to drill it just be careful with the drill bit that you're using make sure it matches with the screw that or the bolt that you want to put on there otherwise you're gonna end up with one that's too big I mean it's better to end up with one that's small so you can always extend it but if you end up with one that's too big then you're just gonna mess up the whole thing you know where real men work on their cars the playground it's exactly where real men work on their cars. If you're using a garage or a driveway, you're, you're being lame. Just use, use a playground. It's so convenient, look at this. Has a nice place to set your bumper. Very nice layout here. So if you're using a driveway, you might want to reconsider the playground's much better. Much better. It's the ugliest thing in the world. There's copyright privileges here. No, it's not, it's Yeah, it's a drive for what the drive. That, that looks pretty good. I want it back. When you're buying parts from eBay, you're probably gonna have these issues as far as like fitment. But with a little bit of fabrication, you could probably get it to sit right. If you're not bothered, if you don't have OCD about that, if you don't really care, then that looks just fine. But it's all up to you. I think it looks perfectly fine. Anyway, so uh, we're going to put the bumper back on later. That'll be it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Everything, not everything, just the lip. I'll put a link down below. Did you but show them if, that you changed your wiper blades? Well, that's a whole nother video, isn't that's it? That's a whole nother video. How to change your wiper blades. 
You guys, wait till you wait. get gas. Wait till... Oh, how to pump your own gas. If you live in Jersey, you probably don't know. I live in Jersey, but I know. So, I will show you. But if you're not subscribed, consider that subscribing down below. Don't forget to like this video, and I will see you in the next one. Stay Peace out. Stay tuned for how to open your gas cap. Just like I take this moment to uh, let you guys know that for Wish.com videos that Sidehot's making, he's pretending to buy them from Wish.com and just saying that he got them there and titling them incorrectly just for views. So whatever he buys, it shows you guys, he's not buying it from Bush.com. So that's a little informative information that I'm giving you guys. On the other hand, uh, his Z is still a piece of shit. It's still broken. It's still, it still needs fixing before modifications. <laughs> <laughs>